Okay, let's say you want to copy and paste the shape. You like the shape, you want another one. Well, what we're gonna first have to do is call a copy. So copy and paste shape. We will first call shape dot copy. But copy doesn't really do anything because it's just in the clipboard. So what we're gonna then do is call, whoops, yeah, call active sheet. So you have to choose which sheet you want it to be on. Okay, and then it's gonna paste it. So now if we come in here, and just because I want to see it, we run it, you will see, let's see here, where did it go? Sometimes they like to jump all over. It doesn't look like we, oh, it copied and put it right on top of the other one. Okay, that's all right. So we have this second smiley face, but they have the same name. So now if we were to call stuff, we'd be getting some weird behavior. So what we want to do is we actually want to rename that. And if, here, let's run this again and because I, I want to show you. Um, Let's go macros, run. You'll see there, that was the behavior I was expecting. You'll see that this one is selected, the copy, not the original. So what we can do then is exploit that. So it automatically selects it. We can say selection.name equals smiley face two. So now we're gonna copy, paste, and rename our copy. And let's run that. And now we see we have smiley face two and smiley face. Okay, super cool. Now we can actually move this around, do whatever we want with it. This is a new shape. So what we're gonna wanna do is grab that shape. So I'm gonna comment this out because we no longer need it. We already have it. And I'm gonna say set shape two. And let's keep it, um, whoops not what I wanted to do there shape two equals and we're gonna say active sheet and then we'll say shapes smiley face two